He couldn't have hoped for a warmer homecoming. Iran's Foreign Minister Mohammad Javad Zarif has received a rapturous reception in Tehran. Having negotiated a preliminary nuclear deal that paves the way for an end to years of crippling sanctions. In return, Iran must curb, though not abandon, its nuclear activities, something the country's top diplomat, just back from the marathon talks in Switzerland, made clear telling reporters the nuclear program will continue. He stressed that under a final deal due to be struck between Iran and six world powers by June the 30th, if any decision is made to reimpose sanctions, Tehran will be able to reciprocate by retreating from its commitments. Friday's hero's welcome for the foreign minister followed a night of partying in the capital on news of the tentative agreement. This after 12 years of brinkmanship, threats and confrontation amid fears that Iran's aim has been to build an atomic bomb, something the Islamic Republic has always denied. Many details must still be worked out to finalize what's still a fragile framework agreement, but President Obama's already hailed what he called an historic understanding with Iran.